Assalamu alaikum guys and welcome to another episode of Smile to Jannah. A couple of days ago I uploaded a video in which I showed Turkish football players who stopped the game just so they could go to the side and open their fast. Mashallah brother! A lot of people in the comments they told me that there was a batsman yeah, a cricketer by the name of Muhammad Rizwan who did something similar. So I did a bit of digging and here's what I found out. <laughs> this year for this Ramadan I am supporting the water project in Gambia headed by the Spot Charity. Those of you that have been following me for a while know I'm very particular with my charities and the charities that I do work with I make sure I've done my research and one such charity is Spot and this year their project is installing boreholes in the Gambia. Now boreholes are much more reliable as opposed to wells which can dry up which see a lot of casualties and broken parts and it's it's a it's a mess yeah very difficult. Boreholes on the other hand are a simple tap system they go there they have a tap they, they fill in their bucket and then off they go. Yeah last year Alhamdulillah I managed to get my own borehole there as well. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna try and put our money towards getting as many boreholes as we can. Link in the description guys. Alhamdulillah. So a couple of days ago Pakistan had a cricket match, international cricket match might I add, with South Africa. Those of you that know South Africa are no small fish yeah, they're an established team. During that match Muhammad Rizwan scored a whopping 50. Yeah, and before we even get to that, let's mashallah look at this Don's celebration. Was off in a jiffy. 50 for Rizwan of just 32 balls. Fabulous innings. Boy, the way he was smacking that ball around, I honestly felt sorry for it. Yeah, it was getting bullied. Oh, that's made a nice noise. That's away. Up in the air and all the way. Shot. Big shot inside out drive. A cracker from Rizwan. Sixes, fours, running back and forth. It's called for two. They beat Williams. He's an athlete. He played a heck of a game. But after the match finished, when the captain of the Pakistani cricket team was being interviewed, it transpired that Muhammad Rizwan had been fasting throughout the whole match. बड़ा मुश्किल काम है रोजे में उन्होंने उन्होंने रोजा रखा था और उन्होंने आज वो जो बैटिंग की और विकेट कीपिंग की आउटस्टैंडिंग होता है कि इतना जो हिम्मत है वो आती है क्योंकि उनको देख के मेरे ख्याल से पूरी टीम काफी जेल होती है और काफी कॉन्फिडेंस आता है उनको देख के यो नाउ व्हेन वी लुक एट दोस शॉट्स ये बॉय वी सी इट फ्रॉम अ डिफरेंट एंगल नाउ इमेजिन इफ ही हैडंट बीन फास्टिंग ये दे प्रोबली हैव टू टाई हिम डाउन मेट आई एम सेइंग एंड नॉट टू मेंशन ऑफ कोर्स द कैप्टन who has surpassed the one day international runs of Virat Kohli. Yeah, so after scoring his a whopping century, you can see his celebration mashallah. And um, it's always special to get your first. And to top it all off Pakistan won with a comfortable 9 wickets to spare. Brilliant performance by the duo and not to mention as I was doing a bit of digging I saw a couple of months ago again facing South Africa they were playing a match and then in the middle there was a bit of an intermission yeah a bit of a pause and Muhammad Rizwan with the permission of the officials <laughs> went to the middle and started praying his Maghrib Salah and mashallah the camera is caught it and subhanallah it was absolutely amazing yeah what's what's truly amazing about this is some of us that are watching we get embarrassed yeah and even when we're at work we want to you know be away from everyone and you know this is uh, it's understandable because we can't be asked answering the questions all the time. Uh, what were you doing Mohammed mate? Why, why are you bending over in the changing room? Are oh, you all right there mate? But it's an excellent opportunity for da'wah when they come and they're like why were you saying stuff in the changing room? I was a bit concerned mate. No I was praying we as we as Muslims we pray five times a day and these sorts of opportunities are the best time to give da'wah. When you start a da'wah conversation it's more difficult because you have to keep the conversation going but when it's the other person that's instigated it they're more likely to pay attention. Seeing him in front of everybody the cameras 
and mashallah, standing upright. This is what I love about the Bhutans, yeah? the Afghanis. I don't know, I just have this special love for them. When it comes to Salah, when it comes to their deen, you know, they don't play no games. What I loved about him was he didn't wait for the other team members. Come on, let's pray Jama'a, let's do this. He just went, did his own thing and mashallah won everyone's hearts. And last time when I uploaded, some people were saying, yeah, it's a Turkish country, Turkish are Muslims and this and that. No, 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 no. You guys are misunderstanding. If you go to our nations, it's unfortunate, but they do look up to the West. Even if you look at the Muslims there, there's infighting, this sect and that sect. That's why it puts people off even more. So the religiosity in our countries is not as great as it once was. So to see stuff like this, especially by the Pakistani cricket team, which in in Pakistan, cricket is a big thing. Yeah, and these guys are cele everybody knows their name. All right, guys, more inspiration yet again. And yeah, don't forget to support the water project, guys. Uh, very, very well needed, especially now in Ramadan. We're really feeling <laughs> that uh, the desire for water, especially when you go to some of our countries, you've got the hand pump and the water well. Flame in Nora, just to get water out, you, you need like a biceps and you know what I'm saying, like a proper workout. I just want water, mate. <laughs> yeah, so now with the taps and everything, mashallah, it's going to be a big, big time saver and energy saver for our brothers and sisters. All right, guys, let's leave it there. Until next time, assalamu alaikum.